what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today we got another commentary on a doubles game at victory field this is a pickup game uh, for honor and glory we got jason and blue versus myself and and yo beautiful left hand short hop from jason there to kick this game off and this game happened a while ago so i don't remember exactly what happened but we're gonna we're gonna play it by eye and talk about it as we go i'm able to pressure blue right there i realized he couldn't see behind himself and so i said let me drive the ball at him as hard as i could Ball on court does get called. And that ball was over, over. But we accidentally sent it to the court on the right. Nice serve from Manyo. Deep to Jason's left hand. Blue saying he wishes we had steam ball. But I, I thought the ball was moving pretty good this day. Score is two serving one. <clears throat> and I try to lazily kill the ball in the middle. It comes up short. I needed to put a little more arm in it. Jason's gonna give me a soft serve in the middle. I try to spike left corner, but I do not connect. One long, one serve. Try to hit a really technical shot here, left hand along the left line, and it goes out. Good hands for Manyo, making great contact. And a big kill shot from Blue. Super cramped on that shot, but he was able to find, uh, he was able to find it on the bottom of the wall. Another good shot from Jason. When Jason's hitting the ball like that, you gotta be careful. You know what I mean? You gotta, you gotta lift it up. Jason's a player who does really well with shots below his waist. Block ball right there. Birdie thought that was hilarious for some reason. <laughs> Jason shooting, going for his shots. Misses the spike, which I was there for, by the way. Four serving two, double. So I'm gonna jump in the middle there. I accidentally hit it to the left side of my body. I meant to, I meant to put it on the right side of my body. I kind of boxed myself out there. That was a very bad mistake. Thankfully, Jason called block. We got to reset. <laughs> Big right hand kill shot from Daniel. It looked like a miss hit, but we'll never know. We're going to count it, no, nevertheless. Primo yelling about something over there. And an unforced error. That should be an auditory blocks, but I think we just play it through. One down. Will anyone call the ball? Wow, no call. <laughs> no call. Guys, you don't have to call a ball on. This is not a tournament. Uh, we're refing ourselves. So if, if any of the four players on court feel impeded by the ball on, they could call it. If not, we all have the freedom to play it through like we did there. If you lose the rally, though, you're going to wish you did call it. So just 
Just be mindful of that. I'm gonna volley with Jason here. And he gets the better end of it. Shooting the ball alongside his body, I couldn't really see it. Let alone make good contact on it. And a miscommunication from Yell and I, we both went for the same serve return. By the way, that serve return there, the left line i'm not sure if jason called block might have got blocked that might have might have been a, a clean box out right there i did have to duck i was afraid i was gonna get smacked uh and yeah they're they're getting pretty rowdy on the court on the right what i was saying before is that serve return is better taken by the power side player because the right side player had you know and y'all had to shimmy over so much to get that ball with his right hand my right hand was already there and we're both righties. Swing and a miss. Jason shooting that left corner again, but it goes out. If I know Jason, he's gonna go for that shot all game. He's gonna go for it all game. If I know myself, I'm gonna be covering it all game. It's best, the best of my ability. And I try to kill it in the middle. Blue, using great footwork there. He was already there, ready for it. I get greedy there. I take, uh, I, I switch over to right side. Somehow I'm able to get that angle out to the right. Caught it on the tip of my fingers. And Blue was not able to get there in time. Closing that gap, that score gap. Another unforced error from Blue. Score is 6-4, I believe. And y'all going for a shot in front of him. And it hits the floor. I think it's, no, no, I think it's 5-6, sorry. 5-6. Jason hitting the floor there, and Blue is gonna take power side. Five, six, second man. Nice angle and yells there though. And another angle from Jason, I'm there as well. And I try to go straight up the left line and it just barely goes out. Like just barely, it's very close. Angle to the right goes out from blue. Jason's gonna return to power side. New game though, six all. So far this game is pretty even. We're going back and forth with shots and, and unforced errors. We're pretty even all around. Um, wow, beautiful right hand kill. Into the left corner, did not see that coming. I don't think anybody saw that coming. had a block there he didn't call it though so we're gonna play on I shoot left corner jason tries to counter with a left hand stiff arm and it does not it does not connect he's rubbing his leg there i wonder if i wonder if he has an injury that we don't know about hold it on something on the on, on the sideline so that's two serves and a huge left hand kill from Aniel. We're warming up right now. We are all warming it up. Black ball.
Big angle by Jason. Looks like it was going out, but then Yell played it. And we're going to get the black ball. Score is 9-6. Wow, left hand in and out by Anyo. Looked out when uh when it's playing fast on the camera. But if we slow it down, we can see that it is a good ball. Ten. About halfway there, right hand by Anyo goes under. Eleven more points to go. Let's see if we can pull it out oh no nobody home okay so when yell called hold it it was it was a late call and he wasn't in range of the shot blue wanted to grant it i don't know if he realized um <laughs> in a fake fake swing from blue i don't know if blue realized how um that and yell wasn't in range rather and yell's gonna exercise some integrity shifting over there to take that shot with his right hand coming up short jason missing the left corner again wow and i'm gonna hit a super Super crispy left hand to left corner shot with a really small window. Jason's gonna hit it out. Two serves for us now. Another what looked like save from Yell. I'm gonna try the left hand cross and it goes too deep. 10 serve and eight. I serve to Jason's left. And nobody's home in the middle. Well, rather, everyone's home in the middle. They're home, but they weren't answering the door. And again, finding success in the middle. Yo, switches to power. And I kind of stay in the middle, ready to go either way. Wow, big drive from Jason. Catches me off guard. Eight thirteen. Good spot by yo. I did not have to move. That shot went right beside my body. And I have people commenting on some of my reels, some of my highlights, saying that, you know, you know, why don't people move? Or like, you know, people are blocking other players. That's a part of, you know, that's a part of the game and it's a part of the skill of it you know it takes a lot of precision it takes a lot of footwork a lot of positioning to be in spots where your opponents have to kind of reach around you to get the ball black ball drive from Jason blue with a up the line shot and then yell hits the ball down second man see if we can't cook and we can beautiful left corner kill right there oh. 
Another comment I got recently was that nice left hand spike, by the way. The right from Yell goes out, side out. Um, the comment I got was that if the ball is if the ball is gettable, then you can't call it a kill shot. What do you guys think about that? I disagree personally. That shot Jason just hit, I would call that a kill shot. Was it gettable? It could have been. It could have been. Again, kill shot for Manyo. Was it gettable? It could have been. You know what I mean? Would you have had to been very close to the wall? Yes, you would have. Yes, you would have. Um, and Yo's gonna want to take power side. So yeah, I don't. I don't agree with that. Me personally. But I wonder what you guys think. Big spike to left corner. Jason gets there though. Another unforced error from and yo and yo's going for shots not all of them are landing and the more he goes for them the more he'll find the right the right uh, point of contact the right amount of power the right angle to put on it you know and that and that's just a part of learning any new shot or just dialing in any any shot that you might already have. Early serve by myself. 15-9. Nice right hand short hop connects. 16-9. Glasses. See if that helps his game. Oh, Ricky. Nice left hand. Kill to the right. It was low, it was angled. Blue could not get there in time. And they're gonna switch formation. See if that makes a difference. Wow, and it does. I'm gonna miss that right hand baby spike. Caught it at the wrong height. And we're gonna switch positions. The right hand cross works. Reason I switched there is because the ball was, you know, I was kind of already in the middle and then Jason hit a soft shot. I'm already there. And I see and yell behind Jason. It's just it just makes more sense for me to just take one step to the right than for Ann Yell to have to uh, go all the way around Jason and try and get a hand on the ball. And then and Yell did the next best thing, which was just switch over to the power side. Again, the middle finds success. Making both players in the back kind of fight for the ball. I knew neither of them are getting a great eye on it. Jason thought that shot was out. I disagree. Side ball, second man. Big serve and um, pretty soft serve return comes back. I send it deep to Blue's left and he hits it out. We're looking to close this game out. Not sure if that was a long or a ball on. Either way, I'm trying to make this next serve good. I wanted that second that 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 second shot and so did my partner and I kind of felt crowded I didn't really want to swing back and, uh, and, and and hit and yo end up hitting the ball out 
Soft tap from Jason. Kills right in front of himself. And a shot like that is, it's not that he's necessarily getting in the way. Um, and, and therefore it's an easy point. No, that's, it's not easy to hit a shot and get in position at the same time. You know what I mean? That takes a lot of finesse. You're, you're managing two things, your, your hands and your feet. It takes a lot of spatial awareness, a lot of accuracy, a lot of coordination to hit a shot and get in position at the same time. It's not three wall where, wow, crack serve. That is an instant point, virtually instant point. Yeah, it's, it's you know, it's not three wall where players get out of each other's way to give you, you know, to give them a chance at the ball. I'm telling him, yo, there, I'm going to stand on the long line. I'm going to make sure the ball doesn't hit it. The left hand up the line goes out by blue. Side out. Nice left hand for Mayo. I'm going to get in there and angle it to the left. And I force an unforced. I get an unforced error from blue. Just by keeping the pressure on him. Whatever he hits, I'm hitting it, you know, I'm hitting it harder. I'm hitting it faster. Keeping the ball on him. And we're going to take that game. Appreciate you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Know the rules? Don't try to bend them. Long volleys? How you going to end them? Say you got shots, then you better send them. Call a timeout and change up the momentum. Know the rules? Stop with the reach and serve kill. Put it in sequence. When it gets hot, we balling every weekend. Starting the AM, playing to the evening.